Hello friends, today we are going to show you unboxing of Y Swingle E8372 which is a 4G modem and having Wi-Fi which can add up to 4 up to 10 devices at a time. So as you can see this is 4G LTE modem of Y. Very sleek, very sharp design and packed in a transparent case. So we are going to unbox it and show you the review so let's open it so this is the modem as you can see we are going to pull it out this is the modem you can see 4g sign here and three other symbols one is for signal stand other is for message and third one is for Wi-Fi so which whichever option is turned on the LED will blink here so this is the modem very sleek design nicely built so we are going to test it with the geo sim this is geo sim we are going to test it with this wingle so let's start let's open it so as you can see there is a sim card slot here so a full sim card will go here and other is a SD card slot so you can put any SD card up to 32 GB it supports and you can manage all the your uh, files from high link application from android and from web based application also so we are going to insert the geo sim we have inserted we are going to cover it now we are going to remove the cap and insert it in the laptop so this is done now let's see what happens we are going we are just looking how the led blinks let's wait a moment so the network led is blinking now message one message arrived and the wi-fi is also on so let's see what is the position in the web based menu so here it goes so the home page is opening here so it's showing connected it's, it is the settings menu you can log in using default admin username and add admin password so you can manage all your settings from here as you can see some message also arrived you can see from here and you can also set all the things from here from sharing option you can use the SD card option you can manage the SD card files memory card files so let's start with the speed test what is the speed it's showing on geo let's see so speed is slow as nowadays the geo sim is showing slow speed so the effect is also showing here we will also going to test it on airtel so let's forget it now you will see it its application on android so as you can see it's connected wi-fi and we are going to open the application of y so 
this is the Huawei application you can manage all the things from here you can also manage SD card SD card is not inserted otherwise you can manage all the files from here so user management one user is connected and you can also set plans do settings whatever you want you can do from your app this is the Huawei app you can download from Play Store High Link app you can do everything from here so we are going to test now for Airtel so we are going to insert the Airtel sim so we are going to removing it so we are going to insert an Airtel sim device so we have inserted it we are going to cover it down and we are going to insert in the USB port so let's see what showing so the network LED is blinking blinking means it is going to connect and once it is stable you can see that it's get connected so it is connected now we will see what is going to show us on the web based UI so it's loading as you can see it's showing connected so so now we are going to test the speed on airtel sim so this is what exactly is the airtel sim is showing this so much high speed 15 mbps more than 15 more than 10 11 12 mbps speed this is very much speed as you can expect it from airtel so this is airtel 4g speed as you can see this is very good speed from Airtel using this UI modem. So this is the uploading the downloading speed now this is the uploading speed. Uploading speed is also good to 2 or 3 Mbps is nice speed. So this was the review. This is a good modem. You can buy it from any online store. UI modem so don't forget to subscribe our channel and like our video thanks for watching